Hey guys, and welcome back to Let's Play Skyrim Special Edition! Today has been one hell of a weird day already. First off, my lizard gave himself a tummy ache yesterday. When I gave him his grubs, he didn't know patience, and he ate the grubs and watermelon, so he overfilled himself. Now he has a tummy ache! Such a goofball. And it's one of those mornings, or not mornings, it's one of those days where it's like, uh... Even though you got a rest, like a night's rest, it's like your eyes feel heavy. It's weird. I'm not sure I like these Alakir warriors hiding out here. They seem like trouble. Don't look at me. Don't do it. 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 Where are you going? <laughs> Bonk. Owie! Okay, you're gonna be a bitch about it, huh? Tell you what. You start running, so I can stab you in the back. Time to die! Cuddle with your friend. So, I had actually just tried to record an episode of uh, Resident Evil 7. See, I uh, bought it uh, when I had my old computer. Shut your fuzzy face. <laughs> and, of course, that computer could not run it. Well, I get this one, and I run a diagnostics on it, and the diagnostics said it will not be able to run it. Well, I ran it perfectly fine, and was recording it perfectly fine, until I realized, shit, uh, my microphone is muted. So I recorded about an hour and a half of uh, Resident Evil 7 with no microphone. I just went ahead and tossed the recording. I mean, like, nobody wants that in a horror game. Uh, leave the shot! Nothing. He looks like a shark with that blade. I smell... I smell adventure. I smell blood! You'll be so much easier to rob when you're dead! Oh, I bet. Maybe you want to try swinging better? <laughs> I got my little snackies around here. Ooh, I was gonna say that hit you right in the crotch. If so, I am sorry. Like, whenever I'm playing games, the last thing I want to do is hit someone in the crotch. That's just low blows, dude. Low blows. Literally and figuratively. Oh, I need these. I also, for the first time today, saw a dragon fruit. I have never seen them before. I saw it in the store, and I'm like, what the fuck is this? We didn't buy it, though. Freaking $6.99 for a fruit. Just a single fruit, and it's not a melon. It's just... You'll say nothing. By Ismir, you'll pay for that. You'll pay for poop. <laughs> now I bet if I just sit here, they'll forget all about me, and I will enjoy a nice, tasty jelly bean. That was not a tasty jelly bean. Nope. Nowhere. I'm standing here eating jelly beans. What are you doing? Are they really losing me? Why don't they just come down the corridor? The only corridor that anyone could come down. Why don't they come down here and say, Hmm.
Well, I leveled up. Maybe I should hold off on that. What was that? This what you want, huh? Whoopsies. <sighs> Ow! Damn, you're just out of my view. Where are you going? Oh my god! <laughs> I used to be an adventurer like you until I took an arrow in my ass! Well, that got her attention. God, my my eye is itchy. Is Just me eating my gourmet jelly beans. Think they know where I? Yep. Damn you! Hi. Maybe you should have mercy on you. You're the one being toasted. Okay. Oh, this is not good. I mean, isn't that what I'm doing? Resist frost. Well, this might work. I forgot I had this. You're a Dunmer, aren't you? You are. You're a Dunmer. This isn't going to work on you. But I know what will. Don't know how you could say that with a sword in your mouth. That sounded wrong. Wow, that sucks. My God, my dog is he yawns and he yawns loud. Oh, forgot that was a factor I had to worry about. You know, I'll go ahead and get rid of these. I mean, I don't really need them. Okay, we already read that. Ooh, 
Ooh, salmon. No, I want the steak, not the... Fuck your ladle. There, now I can eat them. Cool. through. This would be a good place to put a bear trap if you think about it. You've proven your strength for us. Let's avoid any more bloodshed. So you know I'm here. I think you and I have some things to talk about. Stay your hand, warrior. It's no secret why you're here. And you have proven your skill in combat. Let us talk a moment. And no one else needs to die. I think we can all profit from the situation in which we find ourselves. My men will not attack you if you will lower your weapons. Um. Do I have a hidden weapon raised or something? Why are you after Sadia? She sold the city out to the Aldmeri Dominion. Were it not for her betrayal, Tanith could have held its ground in the war. The other noble houses discovered her betrayal and she fled. They want her brought back alive. The resistance against the Dominion is alive and well in Hammerfell, and they want justice. I've been sent here to kill you. Of course, sent by. What is it that she's calling herself these days? Shazra? Sadia? One of those, correct? Did she appeal to your sense of honor? Your greed? A more base need, perhaps? It doesn't matter. No doubt she's convinced you that she's the victim. But do you know why we pursue her? Sadia told me you're assassins. Assassins? No, nothing so crass. Sadia, as you know her, is wanted by the noble houses of Tanith for treason. We were hired to see her return to Hammerfell for her crimes. You can help us with that. And make sure no one else gets hurt. What was her crime? She sold the city out to the Aldmeri Dominion. Were it not for her betrayal, Tanith could have held its ground in the war. The other noble houses discovered her betrayal, and she fled. They want her brought back alive. The resistance against the Dominion is alive and well in Hammerfell, and they want justice. Uh huh. No, I'm not helping them. I was hired to kill you, and that's what I intend to do. I'd hoped we could work something out. That you would see reason. No. That we could avoid having to kill you. Excuse me? Very well, then. If that's the way you want to play it, we will. Someone there? Oh, man. Is my power ready? Burn! What a mean, mean man! I think I should level up my uh, heavy armor here. There we go. Jeez, H. Uh, hmm. Molly, 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 molly. Wow, you are after my bones. 
This isn't over. Victory is yours. I submit. Such a graceful death. Give me your gold. Busy. He's fine. I checked on him. I'll check on Juicy again in a moment, but he seems okay. I think he just has a belly ache. I mean, if I were a lizard and I ate a bunch of melon and grub worms in one sitting, I would be upset too. I would have an upset tummy too. have to charge that sword. Let's head back to- mm. I'm sorry. I had a jelly bean. It's like an orange cream. Oh my god, delicious. Delicious! Since the sword is running a bit low on its charge, I'll go ahead and switch to my destruction magic. Nice textures. There it goes. I should also probably bring sprinting down to a minimum because I've noticed that in the footage it's like it's like there's a oh come on you freaking butterfly fine I'll leave you alone it's like there's a dithering issue where the rendering just breaks and it only happens whenever I sprint out in the open so I'm only going to sprint whenever I absolutely need to But, you know, it's just an inconvenience. Are those... God dang it. Wolf. So far, I've killed more wolves than I've killed anything else. Like, creature-wise. What the... Hello? Who are you? You're Khajiit. Maik. Maik wishes you well. Hey! Maik is very practical. He has no need for mysticism. Okay. Nords are so serious about beards. So many beards. Maik thinks they wish they had glorious manes like Kajit. <laughs> Maik does not remember his childhood. Perhaps he never had one. That's one way to put it. Maik is tired now. Go bother somebody else. Okay. Oh, mud crabs. Toasty! Oh my god, this bean. I think it's supposed to be a root beer. But it actually tastes quite gross. It's like a root beer mint. I don't know what the hell that is. I'm gonna have to look at the bag and see what that is. Because that is disgusting. That was a disgusting bean. Giants. Oh, that's right. Stop the sprinting. I can't keep sprinting. Hello. Oh. Mm 
I have to say, the annoying part about my little rule for games, especially Let's Plays like this, is that um, I don't want to fast travel, because you never know what you're going to stumble upon. I mean, take that example back there. I would not have seen my eek if I had fast traveled. Ew. I've been looking for you. Got something I'm supposed to deliver. Your hands only. Let's see here. Ah, a letter from the Jarl. Moving up in the world, eh? I guess. Looks like that's it. Got to go. Take care. Um. Letter from Jarl Sidgear of Falkreath. Zerus, allow me to introduce myself. My name is Sidgear, and I have the honor to be the Jarl of the proud and ancient city of Falkreath. The fame of your exploits across Skyrim has brought you to my attention. If you are interested in becoming a Thane of Falkreath Hold, I invite you to speak to me the next time you are in Falkreath. Aside from the honor that accrues to the title, my Thanes are entitled to a personal house carl. I also can tell you privately that a choice parcel of land in Falkreath would be available for your purchase, should your services prove useful to me. I look forward to meeting you in person. I remain Jarl Sidgear of Falkreath. Huh, I guess I'll travel down to, to uh, Falkreath soon. Once I finish up some of my business here, I mean, I am supposed to uh, go and see the Greybeards, but um, given this... Right. Excuse me. Hello? Fear not. Come dragon or giant, we'll be ready. I think a giant would be more tolerable than a dragon. My god, with these... Good. what happened to the graphics here? Just broke. Got some good pieces out here if you're looking to buy. Hmm, blades, helmets, pretty much anything to suit your needs. I mean, I don't have much in the way of needs, but, uh, okay, don't, don't forget to check inside the shop if you need anything. I will, I guess. Fresh baked loaves, still warm from the oven. Oh, crafted by the best. There's a rich in Skyrim. Can't neither magic nor the passing of time. You've been a good friend to me. That means something. Where was I supposed to go? You tried mercenary work? It might suit you. Oh, right, Sadia. I'm sorry, my brain stroked off for a second there. It's just like, well. Oh, that was a weird bean. Any news of the Alakir? The Alakir won't trouble you anymore. At last. I can rest safely. You have done me a great service, warrior. I cannot thank you enough. Take this reward. I managed to sneak some of my wealth out of Hammerfell when I left. It's the least I can do. For now, I will maintain my ruse here. You are always welcome in the Bannered Mare. Thank you. See you around. I was going to say, is that slice? What other missions I got here? Uh, Amran's family sword inside White River Watch. Nothing. Not, not, not yet. Um, oh, right. Give the frost salts to Arcadia. Foolish old woman. You know nothing. Nothing of our struggles, our suffering. Nothing? And what of my son, hmm? What of Thorold? The finest cuts, he fresh from the wilds. So don't talk to me about suffering. Your son chose his side, and he chose poorly. And now he's gone. Such is the way of war. The sooner you accept his loss, the better. I will never accept his death. 
My son still lives. I feel it in my heart. So tell me, Battleborns, where is I it? I don't suppose you're going where to Where are you holding my four out? Just browsing. <laughs> if the gods you be kind, someone will take mercy on me and spare a few septums. Holy if they do, him? promise to actually purchase I've something for once. Myself. <laughs> He's uh, my spare, well. I will. Gods know it's Face been it too come. long since I did this real son is dead. He died a storm cloak traitor. And you, you best keep your mouth shut before you suffer the same. Come on, Father. There's nothing more to be said here. All I can think about is my son, my soul. They say that he was killed, but I know better. I know my son is alive. I just ate a cinnamon, cinnamon jelly bean. I hate cinnamon. You look rather pale. Could be ataxia. It's quite a problem back home in Syria. I had it before. Hey, I have some frost salts for you from Farangar. Ah, splendid, splendid. It's for a special brew I'm working on. A love elixir like none other. Maybe I'll test it on Farangar first. <laughs> oh, but I suppose you expect some compensation. Um, here. These potions should suffice. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna see if she has any blister wart. So you're interested in my potions and ingredients? Blister wart and wheat. Because I definitely need to make more potions. Uh, blister warts. You got any more? Do you have any wheat? Wheat, 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 wheat. Wheat. Okay. Potions. Damage stamina are not really good. Brief invisibility, no thank you. Enhanced stamina. Extra magicka, illusion. Frenzy. Thank you. So you're a healer? Of a sort. I don't have formal training in the restoration school, but something just as good. Within these walls, I have all that I need to brew a potion for nearly any ailment. Except death. If I had a septum for every case of rock joint or whitbane I've cured since I opened this shop, I'd be a rich woman indeed. You ever think of returning to Cyrodiil? Why? Because I'm a proud citizen of the Empire? Because the Stormcloaks only want Nords in Skyrim? The Stormcloaks can rot in oblivion for all I care. I've lived in this city for 20 years. 20! Hmm. Come back anytime if you need a remedy. I don't really need a remedy. I'm just brewing potions. I do not have a helmet. Whatever. I bet it does. I bet it does. Thank you! Did I level up? I did. That's right. I had to think about it. I ain't done nothing. Are you always drunk? Only if I can help it. But damn if I ain't almost sober. Hey, in the Bannered Mare, there's this bottle of Argonian ale. The good stuff. Get it for me. They won't even know it's gone. Come on. I'll bring you that ale, old man. Argonian ale. I can almost taste it. Sure, whatever. Life's hard enough with all these men propositioning me. But that bard is the worst. Someone giving you trouble? That bard Mikhail is begging for a dagger up against his throat, the way he goes on about me. I heard him boasting at the Bannered Mare, saying he'll conquer me as a true Nord conquers any harsh beast. <laughs> wow, what a pig. What if I talk to Mikhail? If you want to try, go right ahead. I don't think anything will get through that thick skull of his, though. You get a lot of attention from men? You've got no idea. Half the men in Whiterun have proposed to me. Some were even single. Oh! They'll never understand. No amount of flowers or honeyed words are going to change my mind. Right now, all that matters is my daughter Mila. No man's going to get between me and my little girl. I see it. I see your point. Remember, 
Fresh fruit and vegetables every day. Well, I need to go in here anyways. So. Welcome. Let me know if you want anything. <laughs> Think I got a clean mug around. What can I do for you? You can leave. Argonian ale, eh? Wonder what it looks like. Is it under food? Yes, it is. It doesn't have any special label on it. It's just an Argonian ale. That's not impressive at all. The security in White One is terrible. Shameful is what it is. Hey. I'm a bard by trade. Perhaps you've heard of me. You need to leave Carlotta Valencia alone. Carlotta put you up to this, didn't she? I'm sorry, but that fiery widow is mine. She just doesn't know it yet. <sighs> She's not yours. Stop this nonsense. What did you just say? All I heard was a sound of jealousy. Mm-hmm. Leave her alone, or else. I don't have to take that from you. Oh, yes, you do. Never should have come here. Come on, let's see what you're made of. Ponzi little flirt. Your kind has no place here. Come, really? What do you have against my kind? gonna leave her alone? You know how to throw a punch, I'll give you that. You leave Carlotta alone or this gets worse. You win. On my honor, Carlotta won't have to worry about me ever again. That's what I thought. Yes. Hmm? Hey, Brennan. I ain't done nothing. Here's that special ale you wanted. Well, would you look at that? Argonian ale. My thanks, friend. Here, take this here healing potion. I, uh, found it in the temple. <laughs> sure, whatever. Carlotta? I've got a hungry daughter to feed, so selling my produce is really the only thing I care about. Yeah, I don't think Mikael will be bothering you anymore. This really? You convinced that loot player to stop chasing me? Oh, I'm sure you saw my convincing tactic. I thank the gods, but I'll settle for thanking you. Here's some coin for your help. You're welcome. Until next time. Pigs, man. Friggin' pigs. Can't stand it when they view someone as an object instead of a person. It sickens me. Hi. As if Skyrim didn't have enough outsiders. Now we've got mercenaries. Got something for just about everybody in here. Give a holler if you have any questions. Hey. What do you need, my friend? Do you have moon sugar? Ah, so you're an alchemist then. I'm a cook. No, no moon sugar. Well, damn. Come back any time if you need a remedy. No thanks. I still need to find a mammoth tusk for Isolda, and find Amarin's family sword inside White River Rot. <gasps> Watch, excuse me. So I guess um. I'll head on my way to the Greybeards. But that will be in the next episode. Because I have pressing matters to attend to. So I will see you all next time on Let's Play Skyrim.